Hello. Good day everyone. I'm Tebs. Welcome back to this channel. This next repair is a Pensonic 32 inches LED TV. Not turning on, and no standby light indicator. I will show you how to fix it. If you are new to this channel and you like to learn electronics, you came on the right channel. So never forget to like and subscribe. You can also ring the bell to never miss a video like this. So let's get started. The TV is no power. I should first test the fuse but it's a soldered type. So I will first test the main capacitor if it has been charged or not. The capacitor is not charged. And no short reading to it. Obviously, this high voltage ceramic capacitor is burnt. Let's remove the board to test more components. The multimeter sets to continuity mode, and the beep means a short circuit. The power MOSFET is not shorted. Two of the main rectifier diodes are shorted. Let's remove them. If the rectifier diodes are shorted, the main fuse is also blown.
I'd run out of this type of diode so we will use this type. This diode is a full wave bridge rectifier, it has four diodes inside connected in a bridge full wave. These two are the AC in and this is negative and positive out. And this is the AC in. And negative out and positive out. Let's bend the AC in pins of the diode, and align it to the holes in the board. Let's solder a strand of wire so the positive and negative will reach the hole in the board.
The diode is now soldered properly. Now let's replace the high voltage ceramic capacitor. The value code is 101K. 101 is 0.0001 microfarad. 1KV is 1000 volts. The diode and capacitor are been replaced. I will solder again my resistor to the fuse line then test it. No voltage output. Looks like there are other components that are defective. Let's remove the heat sink together with the MOSFET to see the component under it. A resistor is burnt. This is connected to the source of the MOSFET and to the ground. The value is 0 0.27 ohms. I don't have 0 0.27 ohms. 0 0.033 ohms will work. Hoping the PWMIC driver is not damaged.
The power MOSFET is not damaged. It's a big chance that the PWMIC driver is also not damaged. Let's place back the MOSFET. Let's try it again. It has a voltage output now. Soldering the heat sink. Seems all is ok now. Let's put a regular fuse now. A few moments later. The TV is now working great. Thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed my video and learned something. You can help my channel with your likes and subscriptions. You can also give a super thanks and that gratefully will help. Once again I'm Tefs. See you again next time. Bye for now.